it's a good day to talk about Power Rangers and today we are going to continue our Mega Force series. In this video we will be breaking down Noah Carver, the blue Mega Force Ranger. Let's get into it. Hit that intro Rangers. You are watching the fan club. You're watching the fan club. And you're watching the fan club. Do you know what time it is? And you know what time it is. It's time for the fan club. Let's go. Hey! What's going on everyone? Welcome to the fan club. It is your boy Braz, Dan Brosnan in the building. Welcome, welcome to the show. We have an exciting one for you today. We are going to continue our Power Rangers Mega Force coverage and in this video we will be breaking down the Blue Ranger Noah Carver. Unfortunately, like the rest of these Rangers so far, the storytelling hasn't been great and i hate that there isn't a lot of backstories and stuff to talk about so these videos have been shorter and in mega force i liked what they did with the characters i wish they would have just jumped in even more and explored these characters so much more especially Noah, this guy is basically like Billy 2.0 and they never really jumped on it, but I want to give you a breakdown, even though it's short, I want to someday say that the fan club has covered every single Power Ranger. Now, I don't know how we're going to do it with the comics since it seems like they're always adding new iterations of Rangers, but at least for the show, we are going to try to cover every single Ranger that we have seen so let's get into it noah carver the blue mega forest ranger is a scholar with a thirst for knowledge and a passion for science when chosen by gosei to protect the earth from the war star aliens his intellect and dedication to learning were recognized as valuable assets to the team despite initially doubting his abilities Noah's friend Jake reminded him that belief in oneself can conquer any obstacle. Inspired by these words, Noah successfully defeated a monster and gained the ability to summon the Sea Brother Zord. He continued to grow as a ranger, fixing Jake's snake axe and helping save students from x -Borgs. Noah's determination and intelligence have proven him to be a vital member of the team even as he strives to improve his physical abilities. As the Blue Ranger, Noah demonstrates that mental prowess can be a mighty weapon against alien invaders with his loyal friend Jake by his side. He proves that true strength comes from intelligence, not just physicality. This was your Billy Cranston character, and we saw him grow somewhat, but you know, they had him for how many episodes? Like 40 episodes, and we didn't see great character growth. With Billy, there was a lot of growth from season one to season two to season three. Obviously, Megaforce didn't have a season three, but there just wasn't a lot of meat on the bones for these characters. Now, obviously, tomorrow when we get into the Silver Ranger, I expect way more backstories and things with these characters. And I actually watched these when these came out with my son. I don't remember watching every single Mega Force episode, but it was still new for Power Rangers coming back. Samurai was out now Mega Force, and it was the 20th anniversary year. Definitely checked it out. I don't think it was as bad as everybody says it is, but there are so many plot holes and things that just don't really make a lot of sense within the show but then the characters are just kind of dry at least with dino fury and cosmic fury you can hate on the suits all you want they gave us some epic storylines and yes are there going to be holes okay cool but are the characters good in these Hasbro productions, things that we've been seeing lately, these characters have been really good. They've been molded to impress and to fall in love with and enjoy. These characters, there isn't much to them. Ah, 
it's just like you gotta pick a lane with them but what are your guys's thoughts let me know in the comments i gotta shout out all of the fans out there that take the time out of their day to watch this content you are the real mvps and the reason why we can continue to make videos like this one thank y'all so much and we will see you next time peace i want to give a special shout out to the gold ranger members anime king nick Chaos Draco, The Arctic Operator, Miguel Ortiz, Let's Talk Sports, Papleon Orger, Roderick Ham, Louis Cairns, Salima Ramirez, Danny Nascimento, Stephen Heffelman, Thomas Franco, and Sean Schiffer. Thank you guys again for your support. And if you want a video shout out like this one, sign up to be a Gold Ranger member today. Thanks for watching this video. If you like this content, you know what to do. Hit that like, hit that subscribe button, and hit that notification bell. You can also become a member. Please join the fan club support team right now. We have a Blue Ranger power up and a Gold Ranger power up. This is an awesome way to talk with the fans. Join a fan club official chat group. You can also be featured in our videos. At the end of the videos, I will shout you out. That's if you get the Gold Ranger Power Up membership. Go check it out. Go support the fan club. We love you guys, and thanks for watching. Peace. Hi. Hi. We're Bulk and Skull. We, we have are been requested, requested by, by the, the fan club, club to say, say something funny. Ha ha ha!